Uh, Lotus Shard, Super Viewer Lotus Shard, gives Moonbiter a sploosh. Ooh, thank nice. you, Lotus Shard. That is a total of two splooshes for Mr. Like Moonbiter. Uh, it's four, because I have some carried over from the last Holy last smokes! Woo! What I'm a nice. Start spending that this. is a practical rain the shower of splooshes. It is very difficult yeah. for me to be mean to Grax. To who? To you. I don't, no, it's perfect. <laughs> No, He's scared of you. <laughs> Everyone's apparently afraid of me. I am sorry. <laughs> You're intimidating, man. You do this, you know. He's a little. He's a little shadow person. So. <laughs> and and I do mean he's actually very small. But I noticed. He has that air of danger about him. <laughs> <clears throat> I'd like to that think I don't have quiet menace. Right. I think is is what you were trying to project. Do we know that, that's how uh, I think anybody that, that could? I'm trying to remember. Didn't somebody have like Murder connections? House? Did you have connections where you Papa can? Chops oh, Papa Chops knew a uh, dispatcher. Maybe, maybe John does. Oh, that's right. But John might too. Like somebody that we could talk to to get some sort of fake work order, um, like fake delivery slip or fake <clears throat> something. I could probably make you, make you something. Yeah. Yeah. You think so? I, I, You're up to it. I mean, you I, know, I got, I got a couple of, a couple of tricks up my old, old grab. All right. There. Surprise <laughs> me. Right. Okay. I'm 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 thinking that a, a work order or something might work. Better because it'll give a, a, a reason why there's multiple people yeah. and yeah. why we're not just in and out. Because mm -hmm. if it was just a package delivery, you deliver it, they sign, you drive out. If the security is decent here, they're going to be used to how long it's going to take for something like that. Yeah, it's very true. Or we can count on them not being great. And with a new delivery, uh, at least driver, they don't find the house right away. And there wouldn't be two UPS trucks coming through in one day. Plus, if we're going later at night, deliveries probably wouldn't be happening. <coughs> so if it was that some does kind happen. of, I guess it, I mean it can. It depends on where you are on the route, which yeah. we probably also have to find out. Especially if they are already delivered. <coughs> the new guy gets lost the all the time. Yeah, all <laughs> that's true. So yeah, it's about two thirty now. I think. Oh, okay. I think it's yeah. like our, our, it's our yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's still it's still it's still light out, and. Um, <laughs> 1975. So, a work order of some kind. Yes. Yeah. Um, uh, Grabzy uh, uh, works something up and uh, sends, sends a copy of it to you all on, on, on his comm link. Uh, it's just he, he, he grabbed kind of an image from the internet uh, of, a, of, a, of a FedEx uh, work order, scrubbed off the, uh, uh, scrubbed off the watermark, and, uh, you know, it looks okay. It's fine. Do, you guys, do any of you guys have uh, forgery? Oh, gosh. You can check his work. I don't think so. You know, I was gonna, but it didn't work for the character. Oh, man, I guess I don't have forgery. It's just, it's just personally. I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> Only life experience for forgery on my behalf. I was also very good at signing my mother's name on things. It was, it was nothing like about grades or anything. It was just... Happen like at? I would forget I, to ask her. Probably like yeah. a perception check is the best we can do, huh? Uh, the sun's going to set at six twelve p.m. on October twenty um, first, two thousand seventy five. This root oh, wow. beer, well done. root <laughs> beer, is strong. John, root uh, beer. Grabsy, can can yeah. you get us? Can you spoof a number <laughs> on a comm link? Can you spoof a number oh, from inside the That's gated good. community? Because mm -hmm. uh, here's what I'm thinking, John. If you call as if you are someone in the community oh, no. uh, doing to the front gate, <laughs> ask if the ask that you're waiting for a package, mm -hmm. and asking if the FedEx guy has been here yet. Okay. That'll let us know whether if 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 they've already been and gone, then we need to find another <coughs> another way in and out. Or if they haven't, then maybe we can get in and out before they show up. Or we can hijack <laughs> the truck. The FedEx truck and go in that way. That right. sounds fantastic. Let's get the truck. That saves us time. Mm -hmm. Just hijack the truck. Hijack a FedEx truck. <laughs> Break into a, a FedEx facility and uh, steal one of their trucks. No, just get get hijack the, the truck on the yeah, on, on the route. route. Yeah. Just more, more sleeping gas. <laughs> yeah, we just gotta knock out the oh guy gosh. and put him in the back. Oh, so you're just gonna drive around until you find a FedEx truck, and then you oh, don't oh. want to disguise our truck. I mean, I know it has weapons, I, but aren't they like enclosed until mm -hmm. we? It is very true, just uh, as far as because we are uh, low on time. Yeah. The, there are <coughs> complications. Um, of stealing a truck. Uh, of of, steal <laughs> of yeah, stealing a, a truck. Yeah, there's a lot of complications. Um, 
uh, no, uh, I don't like that plan. I was just flipping right. out right. The, uh, <laughs> never buy, never for, buy. For, for, no, the, the corporation, uh, I mean, they, they know where their trucks are at all times. And, right, yeah, they're um, definitely all sure. low-jacked. Yeah, all and, right. and, and, yeah, at the they're very least low-jacked. And, uh, How quickly so. can we get our, our truck wrapped up then? Well, you have a, I've a got shop. a bunch of yeah, and I've got a bunch of signs that can be basically basically like pasted yeah onto the panels. This is this of is van. no big deal. Oh yeah, for this you. is like we do this and all you, the time. And you got your you got your drones that can come out and help you out too, mm -hmm. uh, and and speed things up. So totally. yeah, you, that, that's why you have your automotive shop mm -hmm. is for situations like this where you can disguise your truck. Yeah, I think that we should make a different. Uh, a truck or I think we should make a different truck. delivery company and not one of the big well-known ones. Okay. It'll, Ooh, it'll okay. be a little more difficult on the initial insertion True. if they're suspicious, but I have an idea. we worry, but we remove any complication of, hey, the FedEx guy was already here, or mm. why are you guys making another delivery, or where's where's Bill? Bill's our normal driver. Okay, Bill. If we're I, a different I have, company, uh, I have an idea. If we're, we're a different company, I think we can circumvent that. We're going into kind of a posh neighborhood, right? Rich Slightly. people like fancy stuff, so. I've got a bunch. Sharpest image. I've got a bunch <laughs> of. Uh, I've got a bunch of like gadgets and appliances and stuff just in my apartment that I can shine up and make look fancy new, and we can turn this into. Uh, I can basically make some appliances and say that we're like an appliance delivery place um, that makes like really fancy high end, maybe a brand that nobody <laughs> knows about because it doesn't exist type appliances Very fancy uh, and then if machine. they open the truck we'll have the actual thing in there that looks like a big yeah. shiny like fancy a, like a furniture and delivery or yeah exactly delivery yeah is, is more is yeah less suspicious yeah but like some little if, small specialty shop but if the if the appliances are large enough we can also be within Behind the appliance them. or in, in or the in, the, yeah. in them mm -hmm. or in box oh, yeah yeah mm -hmm. i like it perfect okay i'll get going I like it. So um, I guess I could uh, get that number and call to let them know to expect a truck from the inside. Yeah, that we've never delivered to the, this community before, but we have a, a very high-end specialty delivery coming so this do afternoon. So we, do we want to... Um, yeah. yeah, that sort of thing. Yeah. Can, can you... Uh, grabs has got a burner. Uh, it's a metal link. It's like a fifty dollar or a fifty new yen uh, phone uh, that you can you can reconfigure uh, to either you know just be doing unlisted or you know th I mean, that's like they have a list of all of the um, different com links that people have. Right. And so you know it's conceivable that it could be somebody from. You just need to find out somebody in the uh, complex because they may run their name. So yeah, exactly. It'd be like a relative of that person or something. Mm -hmm. So Thank then, you. then we can actually approach the door with the appliance, and then that can cause the commotion, um, and at least gets the door open. And we explain the delivery. delay of why it takes us so long to get in and get out if we have to do an installation. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That does. We're getting somewhere. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Right. So let's go to. Uh, uh, you, are we all going to head over to head over to Gidget's uh, yeah. Open Party House? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Cool. Uh, so I'm going to just go into my back room, and I'm just going to start bringing out just random parts, a can opener and a mixer and a, this part of a fridge and this part <laughs> of a dishwasher mm -hmm. and uh, just as many, you know, corkscrews, as many things as I can find. And I'm going to make some kind of contraption that um, if you guys play Fallout 4, you know how their kitchens have like the big arms that come and like mixers and it's like a big robot kitchen. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I'll make like a like a robot kitchen. So it's like uh, big enough that all of us, that three of you could either like fit inside the boxes because they won't actually probably have any guts or components. They'll just right. be facades. Um, so you could either fit in them or behind them, but it'll be big enough um, that they wouldn't be able to see like behind them in the truck. Cool. But And I'll shine everything up. <laughs> make it all spick and span. All my little drones will be coming over and they'll be like cool. my little uh, I think that's probably snow white Ka animals. Katu and myself will be <laughs> hidden inside the items. Yeah. Yeah. And then mm -hmm. I need like you, a delivery. You can talk to people and phase. she's obviously the tech. Yeah. Mm, okay. So okay. I'll I'll make sure that I've got um you know, is some of my drones covered, but I'll put like some kind of coveralls on yeah. that I'm sure that I do work in all the time that's right. got, you know, my big tool belts and all that kind of stuff. Grabs, you, what's, what's the recorded response for security in this place? Oh, uh, it's a, uh, it's a, it's a level A, um, it's a level A uh, uh, zone. Um, so, uh, uh, typically, uh, the, uh, most gated communities uh, uh, have a, uh, have a security team. 
Right. So that's right. Sure. Yeah. They, this one probably has a security team. They obviously it's not public information, um, uh, but they do have uh, armed security. That's one of the things that they had on their uh, uh, on their net. Uh, uh, and um, the uh, uh, the um, uh, oh shit, not Lone Star, but uh, Night Errant. Errant. The Night Errant. Uh, uh, it's classified that as an A, uh, so uh, you can have a, a high threat response probably within like ten minutes. If they get a phone call. All right. I hope they don't. <laughs> I know, but I just want to know how long yeah. we should expect that. Uh, Cover all those bases. If, if we know just how much time we have, or at least an idea of how quickly we'd need to get out of there if stuff goes wrong. Right. Because I'd go to sew a patch on some coveralls or something, a matching patch or something. Mm -hmm. like something like that. So how, uh, you, uh, uh, Gidget, could you give me a... Um, a automotive, um, what's the what's the term? It's a automotive uh, mechanic, automotive mm -hmm. uh, role, just sure. for just for your um, yeah, redesign, yes. uh, your your car redesign. All right. <clears throat> this is gonna kind of determine how quickly you can get uh, that done. Would I get to use my plus two for jury rigging? Uh, for jury rigging, absolutely. Okay, because uh, I mean, I'm basically jury rigging a yes. thing together that doesn't exist in yes. real life. Yes, but, uh, okay. yeah, especially since you're, um, yeah, because it's you're, you're. That's really exactly what you're doing is you're taking a bunch of crap and making it look like more expensive crap. Yes, and nice. it, that's the definition of jury rigging. So. Awesome. Okay, um, so plus two um, when jury rigging gear. So um, okay, so I'll do my. 10 dice, and then is that plus two dice or just plus two to my? Plus two dice. Okay. Yeah. Use my reach. Well, mm -hmm. okay. Mm -hmm. Now my mom's probably watching because I posted the link. Oh, I know oh, it's, mom. It's fine. She's, she watched my charity stream. Okay. Which was two, three, four, five, Plenty. six, seven. Wait. Right? Fours don't count. Oh, four, sorry, it's I'm counting fours like a dummy. <laughs> Three, four. Okay, so four, yeah. Four, four hits. Four, four. Okay, yeah, you, you do a, a pretty damn convincing job, but you don't say so yourself. Um, you know, you, 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 you Grab's able to pull a... Oh, uh, um, I actually have a plus one dice to any test that uh -huh. I have not used yet. Sure. Ha! Ooh. All right, five, five hits. Cool. Um, so was that, that, that was your sploosh? That was just a plus one Oh, that's just a plus one success. Thing. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, is it? Well then, yeah. it's yeah. not die. It's just a success. Oh. Just like then nice, automatic success. Okay, cool. <laughs> five hits. Yeah, you're able. You're able to uh, with five hits. Uh, you're able to uh, to whip something up in fairly short order. It takes you about an hour um, uh, to get everything, but but you know uh, you've got your drones helping you out. A lot of your a lot of the uh, little arms you have like uh, what's that Iron Man arm uh, guy mm -hmm. that he has? Dom, you're a nerd. What's the what's the uh, the Iron Man arm from the movie? <laughs> right. I know. Who, I know. What you're he calls it like stupid and dumb yeah. all the time. Makes fun of it. That's all yeah. anthropomorphic and like. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Anyway, you got one of those. I call that Arbitron from Robo Sh or Radio Shack. Arbitron. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I, used to have uh, I had one of those too. Yeah. And then I'll make a big sign that goes on the side of the truck that says uh, "Future Chef." Future Chef. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. All right. Um, good. Uh, and it looks fantastic. <laughs> and you go. <laughs> I did so well. <laughs> <laughs> and I and I want to just reiterate that I had Snow White drones coming and flying in mm -hmm. and helping with <laughs> the entire process, dusting and screw, turning mm -hmm. screws and giving like life that. lessons. Yeah. <laughs> so I I have a question for you, Tyler, and ask also, away. Also potentially for you, chat. Ooh. Ooh. You guys are always there. Very is a, um, <laughs> I have a bit of confusion here okay. on um, the spell clairvoyance. Okay. Clairvoyance is obviously allows me to see things physically remotely. Mm -hmm. However, the range is listed as touch because it affects me or a person who I designate on there. Uh -huh. And what it, all that it says here, the subject can see distant scenes as if physically present at a chosen point within the sensory range of the spell. But that's not listed anywhere. And the only thing I can think of is maybe it has to do with <laughs> The way the area effect spells are based off of force somehow is mm -hmm. the area of effect on that mm -hmm. as well. But I don't know. But there's nothing that, that explicitly says that for remote detection spells. Mm -hmm. So, chat, if uh, if anyone watching knows, we'd love to know. Uh, this is a learning 
show as well as an entertainment show. Um, <laughs> and if you find something, then we'd yeah. all like to know. Um, so, uh, let's see. Uh, this has been asked, of course, by... Uh, oh, good. Asked and answered by the community. Um, uh, so if you can move your point of view to a point that you cannot see yourself with a complex action as long as it's in the spell's range. It really doesn't answer the question, does it? Not really. Mm -hmm. Hold on. Uh, the subject can see distant scenes. Ah, shit. All right. Um, <laughs> I thought I had it, but... Uh, uh, here's, here's what I'm trying to find out, uh, okay. and I'll, I'll tell you this so that maybe you can just make a judgment call off that item. Yeah. A, I want to know if this place is close enough that I can ride out to it on uh, my motorcycle, <laughs> along maybe along the periphery, stop, use clairvoyance to do a little bit of um, uh, reconnaissance mm -hmm. of the of the grounds okay. <laughs> and what we're walking into, maybe confirm some of this information, and then ride back before we're going to hop in the van and, and drive out for for sure. Got it. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I think I think that's. That's entirely uh, that's entirely doable uh, within within the bounds of the spell. Okay. <laughs> from what I'm from what I'm seeing here. Mm. Uh, I missed so chips. you can shift so your hard. point of view to anywhere you like. How's that true? You can look in the locker rooms. It's actually pretty good. It's got but you cannot aim spells with Sometimes it. Sometimes you just miss right. chewing. So, yeah. Which yeah. which is fine. I miss <laughs> masticating. The simple act of yeah. chewing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. At least not unless you're doing big ass ritual stuff. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, I'll start uh, eating the, dinner the first. The difference between that and astral projection. <laughs> Um, is that when you, class, when you cast clairvoyance, like right it has a smaller door. astral signature than uh, an astral projection does. So right. people are saying, like, why wouldn't you cast astral, just, you know, just astrally project? Well, but um, it also, and here's my understanding, mm -hmm. is clairvoyance is going to give me what it actually looks like mm -hmm. if I were present and reviewing everything, whereas mm -hmm. if I check it out astrally, everything in the physical world is going to be kind of hazy and weird Yes, and have astral signatures and weird stuff that might not correspond to what actually is there. Absolutely true. That's, okay. that's how I, that's yep. my justification. A good, a good interpretation. I like it. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Cool. Uh, so well, is this place close enough? So the next question is, is this place close enough for me to ride out, do a little recon, and then come back? Uh, are you talking about the uh, the house or the, uh, the booth? Um... Both, like riding out to where the community is, and mm -hmm. then I don't know if, like, I don't know how big the community is, but usually there's a there's you know a border that you can go around. So if I was driving around side streets, mm -hmm. it um, might be possible for me to get close enough to, to see the. Um, it's uh, what did I say? Well, it, it was it, it was two thirty when we did our plan. Mm -hmm. so it it was an, an hour, hour while she's working thing. on that. Uh -huh. So it's now three thirty. Mm -hmm. um, you know that it, it, it does have a perimeter fence, mm -hmm. um, so this, there's only there's only one entrance uh, right. in, into and out of the facility, uh, or in, into and out of the complex. So, um, I mean, the the house itself is sort of centrally located in there. Um, so, so I can't get close enough to be able to see it. You'd from, have to be from the streets. You'd have to get past the guard shack somehow. Okay. So yeah, you can't. Yeah, there's 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 no easy way to see it on the streets. It's it's a relatively flat and you know hard hard to pick out the. Um, you, I mean, you could astrally project probably, uh, and and speed your way over there and kind of scatter out that. But. Uh, All right. Um, how about if I. Which I may also try, but mm -hmm. um, then I think the first thing I want to do is. Ride somewhere where I can get the guard shack in vision okay. and use clairvoyance to see if I can check that out. Maybe look for shift changes or any other time where it might be um, uh, distraction going on between mm -hmm. between who's there. Like if we can show up at the end of one shift and leave at the beginning of the second shift, mm -hmm. yeah, that's great because it's fewer people to compare notes or mm -hmm. anything else that, that goes wrong between those two items. Mm -hmm. Also, looking inside the guard shack might give me details about how vigilant they actually are. That gives, that, but that gives two people that have seen us, correct? Hmm? Well, you For guys girls. will be hidden. Right. So they won't see you. They will see his face. Right, his handsome face. But, but, right, but is it the same all, guy? All, are, all, were all you suggesting, all gonna, right? All they're going to see from me is they're going to see a guy on a motorcycle ride, zoom by the, the gate. Maybe have a minor a terrifying orc on a huge motorcycle, <laughs> dressed like a crazy person. Yeah, in but this what? But, but, <laughs> but, <laughs> oh, damn! Oh, my! Qual <laughs> <Cool> security! <laughs> but what I'm asking, did you just say, f 
for, because um, you were talking about changing shifts, so is that two different security cards we have to deal with? Well, the idea, I think... I know it gives us more time, but... I, I, I think the idea is that uh, if everything goes according to plan, we won't need to worry about who sees us because all they'll see is one, one group. Uh, first guard will see a group who goes in to do a, install a delivery, and the second group will see a, you know, a company that completed a delivery and is leaving. Do we have to check in with the guard when we leave, though? Uh, or do we certainly. just leave? No, we'll, we'll have to check in. There's, so there's just more. I'm speaking from personal experience. You mm -hmm. have to check, check in, in and, on out. And, yeah. and out. So, mm -hmm. so there, it, it just makes it a bit more complicated in, in case uh, we'll have to the check second in. guy is more of an asshole. Yeah. Pressure is hopefully off well, by the second guy. Well, mostly. I don't know how much. You never can know for sure. As, assuming, as, assuming, assuming, we're, assuming we're not making a hot exit. Um, the <laughs> second <laughs> guy. Assuming. The yeah. second guy is the second person is only going to see. A delivery van that checked in and uses its card and checks out. A delivery van that it doesn't recognize. Because it's yeah, from but, a posh but that was new already company. cleared. Right. <coughs> that was already cleared in. Niche company. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, What's George's wife's name? George's wife's name is. I wanted to say Martha, but I think that's wrong. Um, Martha. Nancy. Martha. Not My Nancy. Name is Nancy, you're a swell lady. Uh, she she uses a lot of Asian influences in his cooking. A lot of I ginger spices. I am glad you found nice. out about their cooking rather than if they have a cat or not or you're, what it is. He's always working hard. You're a foodie, uh, Grabsy. It's all part of it. Uh, I mean, I, I like food. I, I really you guys are too easy on him. Can't eat a whole lot of uh, fancy <laughs> food. It's you know. Cats, you know, gra Grabsy has, has a little his unstable uh, idiosyncrasies just like we all do, but so. he does good work, and he. Uh, doesn't cause any problems. <laughs> <laughs> he just kind of looks away. He's embarrassed. <laughs> His face, face flushes. Oh. Slightly a lighter shade of green. <laughs> <sighs> um, when okay, we, uh, when so we arrive, I'm going to have big, like, mechanics goggles on and uh, like grease smudged across my face so ooh. that I'm less recognizable. Cool. Do you have a disguise? Uh, no. Can you make a disguise roll? Um, but I can try. Yeah. Uh, you can. Uh, you do it. I'm uh, not it's a, a disguise. trained or anything, yes. so it'll just be an untrained. It's I intuition uh, minus one. Okay. You can disguise her. Do you have I, disguise? Yeah. I can. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. How are you? Give her, give are, her are the old disguise a Are we going to metagame for a moment? Uh, I, I have... Uh, I have five dice on disguise. Do you I have six. I'm probably, I'm probably like the better choice, right? Yeah, you got a makeup kit. Yeah, I'm gonna put everybody together. I have six driver. on disguise. I have six All right. All right. So you you were the least qualified to disguise yourself. I was like, no, please allow me. <laughs> no, honey. <laughs> honey, have a seat. I'm wearing a red headband. <laughs> <laughs> no one's gonna recognize me, guys. Three. Gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, uh, did you roll? Uh, I am fin to. Give it a roll, brother. Do you, do you have any, uh, Where are you from? Do you have any splooshes you, or anything? Sorry. Oh, do yeah, don't wait. Get an extra die? Utah. I'm from, yeah, I do have a sploosh. You can use that before or after, right? Yeah. Oh, okay. okay. Correct. Cool. Because of what you said, that's what <laughs> I thought. Yeah. Fin two. <laughs> a oh. Three successes is three not bad. Success. Three successes? That's really good, actually. Yeah. Okay. You 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 do a very convincing job. She looks sufficiently greased up and dirty. Yeah. So um, mm. yeah. I mean, it wasn't. It, honestly, it wasn't that much of a stretch. Yes. But, uh, but I did a lot of the work for you. Yeah. 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 You, you you make it uh, convincing enough. It, it's more like finger smears. It's like convincing. It doesn't yeah. look like it was applied by it a brush. It looks like they were applied by my real fingers. Yeah. Is that what you're saying? Yeah. It's legit. Nice. So <laughs> kind of. <a> it's <laughs> almost as if I've wiped the spread off my own brow. <laughs> Mm. So this is that that takes about a half hour <laughs> to, uh, uh, to to get all all, all all of this stuff figured out. Yeah, bring get, a mustache on. You know, you you've, you've sewn on <laughs> yeah. patches, and you, you know you're kind of looking good. You guys are just kind of sitting there twiddling. So um, I, I think you are I, free to do I, your little motorcycle side trip yeah. if you want. Though. Can I? I just want to take a moment mm -hmm. outside as saving throw here. Okay. Um, so my understanding is three successes doesn't sound like a lot, but that's a target number that that whoever tries to penetrate the disguise yes. is going to need to. Uh, beat in order to be able to to see through it, mm -hmm. um, and in this case, if they see through it, they're just going to see a different dwarf. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so it's, I don't think it's that big a deal. <laughs> they're like, wait uh, a minute. Right, and um, 
if they're not suspicious in the first point, they're probably not even going to take it. Mm -hmm. So I, I think that a lot of the numbers that we're using seem really low. They seem low to me. But the the thing to keep in mind is that since it's based off a dice pool and mm -hmm. you could roll really crappy at any time, three or four is like a really good number you know, as a successes. To put it in perspective, in order, if you were to roll four successes on a standard perception check, that's like finding a secret door, needle in a haystack, or hearing subvocal voice. So like hearing quieter than a whisper. So get, getting something with, with, with a, setting a fourth threshold for her disguise is actually pretty good. Mm. All things considered, not bad. So. Mm. Nice. <laughs> Dom's just not impressed. Sorry, Dom. Meh. <laughs> you, wanna, you wanna fight about it? <laughs> so, uh, motorcycle side yeah, quest. So what? You yeah. Want the <laughs> <laughs> Get your motor running. Do you wear a helmet <laughs> on your motorcycle? <laughs> safety first. This is important. Yeah. My son is watching. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, safety first, of course. <laughs> Henry, go to bed. And it has the full visor <laughs> with work <laughs> tests. <laughs> Actually, yes, it does. That's great. I love it. Instead of the mohawk, you know. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. I think mohawk and the tusk. Yes, I yeah. think so too. Full on. Okay. Full on. Like as orc as orc can be. Yeah. Orc so tribe. you're gonna do this in the half hour that they're putting their makeup on and getting all hurty. Um, Gotta put my face on. So yeah, while while they're doing that, you're gonna go motorcycle. Do you want to do anything in that half hour, Tattoo? <clears throat> um, I'm sorry, I was eating chips. Yeah, we can wait. <laughs> hiccuping, eating chips. I did oh. I not tell you guys that I have um, chronic hiccups, so oh. I do apologize. Oh, okay. Do you really? I do. Apologize I to goodness. Chad. Don't apologize to us. Literally every day. So well, I now we sorry. Like I know. <laughs> well, they're the cutest hiccups ever. Well, so I know. At least there's that. Might be Thank like you. I had a friend that would have. It's, yeah. it's, yeah. Not. it's not. I feel like it would be kind of terrible. I have had them four years every day. Web MD. Are hiccups good for my four years every day? Yeah, wow. but I normally just have a couple. Uh huh. They're but not like fits that you can't. But so far through this session, I. I what was it? A, you're also drinking right something carbonated. That's yeah, true. I guess. Was it a traumatic experience that uh, gave you the hiccups? Did you get like punched in the stomach so. super hard? I so I read up stories on this though, and there was some man like back in the day that, for whatever reason, a hog fell on him, and that he started having yeah. hiccups. But he has like never stopped until he was like 81, and they stopped for, a, and then he died a year later. Yeah. <laughs> His body's but like, I can't, I can't He was go in the Guinness Book of World Records, the mm -hmm. 1988, and I remember reading that, being like, yeah. oh, I think he slaughtered a hog or something. There was another guy who slaughtered a hog. Oh, and then had God. For like seven yeah, years. No, I didn't do anything to deserve the these. Oh, no. Um, okay. but Sorry, I, like, not speaking blaming again. I, I, <laughs> I was trying to think of something. No, I asked my I'm family. I'm glad you said it, not me, but yeah. <laughs> because to me, they're so normal, because I have them just all, you know, yeah. all the time or every, every day. And it wasn't until I started my new job in July that everyone was like, what? Was that noise? <laughs> <laughs> Why are you doing that? Yeah, and everybody's like, you should go to the doctor. I'm like, they're hiccups. They're it's hiccups. fine. Yeah. Well, but this I, noise is coming out of your body. <laughs> finally, <laughs> when I went to the doctor and I was like, hey, real embarrassed. Like, so I have hiccups off. every day. Is that right? So, um, mm. but hopefully, she, it's not a normal thing. Mm. Um, I mean, you hear of it, but you don't really run across. And to me, because People it's, with, yeah, but I asked my hiccups. mom, I was like, do, do I always, have I always had hiccups? She was like, yes, since I remember. I'm like, why did no. you never check into that? <laughs> oh, honey, it was fine. We didn't worry <laughs> about it. Fine. I didn't want to concern you. <laughs> you were such a sweet child. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I'm Michaela's mother. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I signed up for this Twitch thing, and I love it. <laughs> oh, uh, speaking of which, guys, if you have Amazon Prime, Oh, yeah. And you are uh, you are mm -hmm. signed into Twitch. You can give us a free subscription uh, if you so choose. And if you're if you're using that for somebody else, switch it back to us because we need it more. <laughs> because we have yeah. fewer subscribers and we're new. We want to look good for our friends at Twitch. It's what I did. Yeah. <laughs> well, actually, I think that's totally. The and actually, it's I keep true. meaning I keep meaning to do it. I just haven't done it. Yet. Um, I didn't know that. That's great. I'm yeah. sorry. I'm sorry to hear that. Uh, that's um, fine. Kayla. It's mm -hmm. tragic. No. <laughs> Thank you. That makes it so much better. Yeah, no. <laughs> oh, we love Michaela with yes. her quirky little hiccups. I know. Just, the cutest little hiccups. Uh, does, <laughs> yeah. uh, uh, oh, what does Ketu want to do? So, yeah, does, does, does like Ketu have a. a uh, we want to have a, like a. a way to pass a, the time? An hour? Yeah, you got a half hour. Half hour. You don't um, have to do anything. I feel like I would always be doing something. 
Um, Can't you prowls? Cleaning your guns. Prowls or the something? house. Mm. I don't know. She does, he doesn't Oh, yeah. that's right. You're unarmed. You I have a grappling knives. gun. That's I right. could sharpen my knife. I'm <laughs> <laughs> staring at grabs you the whole time. <laughs> that's going to help me make friends in this group. Yeah. Right. Do you want friends, though? No. Those are just future Deep enemies. <laughs> <laughs> Deep no. If you have friends, you're going to just lose them. They can Aww. use their friendship against you. That's true. And catch who is beholden to no man. Real talk. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> real, real, real talk. I'm sharpening my knives. So yeah. Okay. Sharpen your knives and staring at Grasby. What's cool. Grasby uh, doing? Grabsy, uh, Grabsy's, Grabsy's in VR. He's, oh my god. He's, he's looking a, at food. He's playing a it's video food. game. <laughs> he really is. He's just straight up playing Call of Duty 16. Cooking Mama 16. Um, after Duty. I get my makeup on, I'm going to go pull Grabsy's goggles off and snap them back. Um, his goggles are, are in his brain. Wow. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's how they were? Yes. That's, oh. that is, I want to do so many, like, just mean big sister things to yes. Grabsy. You know, all that's the time. actually just flirting, though. It's a mean big sister thing. Yes. Well, I don't know what that is. Yeah. He's a child. <laughs> <laughs> Leave an orc alone. Uh, let him work. Hi, <laughs> uh, uh, just I'm doing research on on the the uh, Canter Squad. Uh, uh, hang on, guys. Guys, I'm sorry. I got something. You nervous, Grabsy? What? No, we're good. <laughs> <laughs> what were you watching? Sorry, guys. BRB. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Nick, let's do your yes, thing, brother. Sir. Okay. Before we started, mm -hmm. can I, I gotta I gotta hit the old uh, bathroom real fast. Is that cool? You gotta go cleanse right, the cool. juice. I'll be right back while you do it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. That's how it works. Motorcycle running. <laughs> oh yeah. Motorcycle don't, don't, highway. Don't product place. <laughs> We're not getting sponsored by them. <laughs> okay, you. Uh, but, we, but we could. But we be. could. Be. We could be. <laughs> it's about 15, 20 minutes away. You're splitting lanes. You're driving like a crazy person uh, with your cool uh, tusk helmet. Yeah. Uh, and you, you, you arrive. I love it. I love so it much. too. I, uh, you arrive. Looking to make it now. Right. I don't have a motorcycle, but um, you arrive at the this location. Week. Uh huh. We'll just Next week. say yeah. these two dice here, and uh, yeah, there's the guard shack. Um, okay. So, so the plan is, I'm not going to do it like right here. I'm okay. going to go down the road so okay. that I can see where the guard shack is. All right. I'm hopping off the bike, and I'm holding up a comm mm -hmm. like I'm taking a call. Okay. Uh, like Convincing. Come in. Right. And then while that happens, I'm going to cast clairvoyance. Um, and while I do clairvoyance, I can't see out of my own eyes, mm -hmm. so I'll just be. I still move my body and stuff, so I'll be doing the... Mm -hmm. And clairvoyance, that, that works like for that. audio as well, right? No, that's uh, clairaudience, which ah, I do not have. You don't I have not. Clairvoyance, I can see, but I cannot hear. Okay. On there. So um, I'm going to ignore it every time. Try to. I don't going to do that. Ignore what? solid for you. Exactly. <laughs> um, so that's going to be off of uh, spell casting. And, and you're casting it on the booth? No, I cast it on myself. Okay, and then I can move the perception around as I Got as it. I look. Okay, so I'll look around the outside of the booth. If there's any sort of a window or door, which there will be, because they have to be able to take the tickets and check you out, then yeah. I'll be able to shift my perception inside the booth and take a look inside of that. But I have no physical presence. Cool. Okay. Um, so yeah, you uh, uh, you. You slip into your uh, uh, Claire audience state as you walk around, and you're able to kind of perceive the booth. Uh, your your perception moves up to the booth. Uh, it's a it's a pretty bog standard uh, a security booth. Um, uh, it's got a it's got a door on um, here. This is this is a better representation, oddly enough. Um, so uh, this is what you see. Um, it has a entry door back here. Uh, it's got a bulletproof. Uh, I mean, you assume it's bulletproof. Uh, a window right here and another one on the other side. Right, um, for in and out. Yeah, it doesn't look particularly armored. Um, there is a scanner right here, um, an RFID scanner. Um, and uh, yeah, and that's about it. It looks like it's made of wood. Okay, is that RFID scanner on the in, the in, the coming in or going out? Uh, it's, it, 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 is, it is on the, um, the coming in. There's or, is that, or is that just for, is that just for, um, like residents, like if residents have an RFID scanner, they can just drive right through. Correct. Okay. Yeah, it looks like it's for after-hours stuff. Okay. Um, and, and so yeah, this is this is one of those that you know you, you just have you just have it up on your car mm -hmm. and you and you can go and, and it'll 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 pop you through. So, okay. Um, there's a there's a there's a camera on the booth here and here. Okay. Uh, to record license plates. Uh, it's, it's not on on all four cam four corners. It would be so here sure. here here here. Okay. 
Uh, inside the booth, is there like a posted uh, guard schedule? Um, yes, the, there is a, um, uh, well, it's not posted, uh, 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 but uh, there, there, is, there is a guard in there. Um, you don't see uh, any, anything that says what the schedule is. It's probably online, um, if it's anywhere, or online in the matrix. Um, so, Is there anything I can tell from the guard? Uh, so, for example... Uh, is the guard's first guard male or female? Guard is a male. Male what meta? Uh, he is a human. Okay. Human. human. All right. So this, um, so is his uniform rumpled like he's been on duty for multiple hours? Is there like the remains of lunch there? Like any indication that I can get that he's at the end of a shift or the beginning of a shift? It is, Anything it like is that? four o'clock now? Uh, yeah, ish. Um, he's a pretty rumpled guy, uh, uh, just in general. Um, so it's, it, it's, it's, it's kind of hard to say. Um, but he's, he's still a little spry. He doesn't, he doesn't, you know, looks like if you had to guess, um, uh, you'd say it's, it's early in his, sh in his shift. Okay. Um, but, uh, he's, he's an older gentleman, uh, mustache, uh, rings under his eyes, but he could just be tired. Okay. You know, it's hard to say. Um, give me a, uh. Uh, what would that be? Perception. Just give me a, a, a perception. Are you trained in medicine at all? Uh, I'm trained in first aid. First aid? Okay. Um, which one? Whichever one is better. Uh, give me that roll. Okay. That's perception. Perception is? Okay. Uh, that's three successes. Three successes? So, yeah, I'm not um, going to add a sploosh or anything. I yeah. Um, three seems pretty good. You don't see any, any food crumbs or any, any food uh, in the area. Um, you would imagine if he was working through his lunch that he would probably have his lunch in there. Um, he does have a, uh, a, a, um, a, a little bag uh, sitting on the counter next to him that you assume is dinner or something. Um, so, yeah, you think he's still early in the shift. Okay. Um, is like there he may have just got there. Okay. Is the, um, what's the general overall condition of the booth? Like, is it very, is it very neat and people are paying attention? Or is it, you know, a little more slovenly? A little and slovenly. like, things have started to slide a little bit and... Yeah, yeah. It, it, they, they don't do a great job of keeping it up. Um, you know, the computer's a little bit older, you know. It's, awesome. It's, it's just, you know. It, it, it's, it's not, it, he, these guys aren't top of the line. It's only an A security rating. Um, Oh, a is A is a, a lowest, is, or there's triple A, double A, A, B, uh, C, and then gotcha. I think Z about or something. It. Yeah, forget <laughs> about it. So it's top of the line, but not top of the yes. top of the line. Yes, it's a, it's kind of your your it's typical upper, upper middle class. The fact that they have a security booth is all, but it's probably the the lowest quality security booth that you could find in a gated community like okay. this. Anything lower than this, they're not going to have security guys watching it. All right. Um, do I get any? sort of indication that he is uh, twitchy or a chip head or anything like that. No, he, he, he just seems kind of sleepy and old. Okay. Sleepy and old. Life got him. <laughs> like, it wasn't you know. drugs, life got him. Yeah, oh. like what, what is he Coffee doing? Coffee and the donuts, not the, <laughs> not the booze <laughs> and the drugs. Uh -huh. okay. What is he doing with his, yeah, his 50-year-old, he's working in the damn security booth like a, like a goddamn kid. It's kind of the vibe you get from him. Okay. No respect to him. Right. Oh, so no. Give that's the worst. Anyway. Mm -hmm. Well, he doesn't get paid enough. It's either that, that or he, he, uh, he, he's, uh, oh, I just got real tired. Um, <laughs> 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 got okay, he's falling asleep. Security guard. She needs to hiccup yeah. and wake up. Or he, or he takes it way too serious. Mm. I hope he's just super lazy. Okay. Um, I can't think of anything else that I would look yes. for there. Mm -hmm. Um, Oh, one thing. One thing I do want to check out real quick. What uh, are, is there any security measure in place to stop a vehicle from just blowing right through the gate? Like, yeah. is there a spike strip, or are there, you know, pillars that pop up out of the ground, or anything like that? It is an actual uh, gate. Um, that it's it's not it's not a juju. It's an actual right, right. gate. But but besides the gate, which which uh, I know op is going to uh, open from the inside to be able to let. Uh, cars it's it's out? it slides open. 
Oh, it slides so it's just open? one entry, like one entry point. It's not where you go in this way and then out that way. Right. Well, yeah. It's it's you 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 go in here and the, and the gate slides this way and then slides closed. Same with this one. So it's got one of those. You so, know, the, so there's two. A sensor as yeah. you come out. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It'll so it, it, it'll out. let you go. And they yeah. both have the, the RFID. You don't know. You don't okay. know. There, there's a. Um, you don't see. You don't see uh, an RFID reader uh, for the uh, exit. Okay. okay. So, but besides besides the gate, I don't see anything like like I said, spike strip or your tires do, you reinforced? know S the STD. I would think. So um, not on the road. Damage yeah. or anything. Uh, yeah. Not not I on like the road. Yeah, the, like the, you spikes. don't you don't have one of those. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there's something on the road. Uh, there does appear. I mean, it, it's it's barbed wire. Sure, sure. And so uh, you know, scaling it might be a problem. Uh, they probably have some other countermeasures there as well. Uh, but on the road, there's 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 nothing that's going to pop the tires. Okay, so, great. That you could see. <laughs> okay. Other than the gate, which is a pretty decently strong metal gate. Sure. It's not like you're. It's not like a chain link. You know, this is actual security gate. So. By the way, guys, if anything happens to this cat, I actually in real life like cats. <laughs> Just, I don't want anyone to like hold this against me. <laughs> Michaela's the cat killer. Yeah. I Bear that in mind. I volunteer at like a kitten rescue oh, sometimes and, cool. and, and socialize kittens. So anyway, I just isn't, don't want that to Isn't be. one of your qualities I won't harm animals? So I don't want to be. But for whatever reason, I don't like this, the big cats. Um, it was originally, that's what I was looking for earlier. Yeah, I thought I'd put um, that as, as one of your, one of your, like, code uh, is. Qualities, I think, problem. the second page. Will not harm animals. Does that include gas? Oh, no, it's a different. Guessing's humane. Wh where would it be? Because I remember seeing that on my, th th since we didn't know. Yeah, I, I don't know if I. Uh, Are these oh, single sided? Code of Honor, animals. Yeah, <gasps> Code of Honor. So, yeah, that's, <laughs> that's that, that fits the Michaela. I guess at that, and I was right. Um, so, yeah, Ketu will not harm animals. You guys don't know. That. So, all that talk Unless about, he all that, talk about that cat's going to die. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say it was going to die. <laughs> yeah. I it just, may die at somebody else's hands. <laughs> It'll be real sad, but just not in front of you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Go up to the roof and have a cry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, anything else you want to do with the? Uh... Uh, no. So I, th I think that's that's everything I'm gonna get. So okay. I'll, I'll uh, drive back the and then um, cool. share, share that. <laughs> <out>. <laughs> yeah. Just like that. <laughs> okay. okay. Perfect. <laughs> Cool. Ah. So you you go cruising back, and they're just sitting across from each other, doing each other's makeup. Mm -hmm. um, Ketu is sharpening her knives and okay. staring at Grabsy. Grabsy's off in another world, so he can't. He doesn't know he's being intimidated right now. But when he wakes up, he's gonna shit himself. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and you uh, guys are all prepped and ready. It would seem. Yeah. All right, guys. Um, the the. Guard looks like he's relatively new in his shift, so I don't think we're going to get a shift change going in here. Um, he's an older gentleman. Uh, the whole operation at the gatehouse looks a little sloppy. Uh, it's not tip top. The older older model computers. It's a bit. It's a bit dingy. They're not really concerned about spick and span and spit and polish. Um, I don't see any sort of. Uh, be, besides the gates, which slide open, I don't see any sort of anti-vehicle um, devices that would stop us from getting out of there hot if we need to. Uh, obviously, that's not the plan, but just so we know, the, there is barbed wire around all the, the tops of the fences, so exiting without the vehicle might be uh, difficult as well. And what day of the week is it? Is it a weekday or a weekend? I think it's a Thursday. Okay. Yeah, so, it's a Thursday. So there might be like some after-school stuff going on. May, hopefully, the kids aren't there, but I don't know. What a Thursday. Strip club and then this. <laughs> I know. It's like when it's busy. <laughs> Best Thursday ever. <laughs> All right. I hope that's consistent. I hope it wasn't a Wednesday. I may have said Wednesday last week, but I meant it to be on a Thursday. All right. <laughs> It was Thursday, that's guys. It's almost Friday. Point, yes, yeah. it is. Everything yeah. will up. fall apart if it's really Wednesday. <laughs> <laughs> I had a very specific date picked out. It's in October. It's October 21st. So, oh. so it's a little, it's chilly. Then. Oh yeah, mm. yeah, yeah. the leaves are turning, <laughs> but it's evergreen leaves because it's Seattle. And <laughs> Seattle's the best. So are, are we going to go to like Google calendars <laughs> oh. and see if October twenty first, twenty seventy two is? Actually I Wednesday? did. That's what he I did. did that. that did that's you really? What he gave, he I pulled that up from okay. Google's calendar yeah. for like twenty. Wow. Yeah. All right. It's six twenty one. That's game prep, guys. That's yeah. dedication. Great. Yeah. Definitely Take that disorganized play. <laughs> I'm putting you on blast, Tom. <laughs> <laughs> 